experiment name differential pulse code modulation this is a block diagram of differential pulse code modulation block diagram of differential pulse code modulation okay modulation and demodulation in the experimental trainer kit differential pulse code modulation and demodulation two kits in this experiment we are using two kits modulation kit and demodulation kits are separated okay if you are observe kit nearly this is af generated our message signal message signal transmitted to sam summer block summer next prediction filter internally connected to the summer block okay next sample here next block is sample and hold block here sa clock signal sample signal internally connected we no need to connect any extra wires it, it is by internally internally connected next a by d converter next shift register parallel to serial converter okay this is the dpcm output final dpcm output from here first up, apply message signal to summer block input okay next prediction filter internally connected and sample hold in connected observe output from if you want to observe, first observe the apply message signal message signal apply the message signal from here message signal i have given 376 hz and 2.65 am okay next to field the output is connected to summer uh, sample and hold output connected to the abd converter next uh, output taken from the shift register okay if you are observe output from here i have remove this wire and connected at the output of the dpcm i have get this output this is the encoded output stop the stop it and note down encoded output binary data 1010 according to our quantization levels next this is total modulation block uh, one second shift the signal next going to demodulation block first apply modulation dpcm modulation output to input of the dpcm demodulation next uh, keep common ground this is ground wire connect ground wire next one is apply clock 2 to demodulation kit here clock 2 and clock 1 two signals i have applied here this is demodulation block again check output at the demodulation also i have checking output from here observe here stream moving stop same previous whatever output we have getting at the input side uh, dpcm output side same output we are getting at the demolition demolition input okay if you are observe at common ground and uh, clock 0 and clock 1 serial to parallel shift register again whatever process we are perform in the modulation process we perform in reverse process in demolition previous year did here uh, serial to parallel converter shift register now here we are using serial to parallel converter here we are before we are using parallel to serial next a by d converter here we have used d by a converter okay lpf and prediction filter finally we got output from the summer here other terminal ground for uh, this output demolition output i am using this uh, analog cro why this is uh, if we get low output so we are observe output from the analog cro we have got distortions while doing checking the output uh, by varying this inputs message signal we will get proper output okay by varying input message signal by varying this input message signal we get proper output then again we when then only we need, note down the dpcm output and dpcm output readings and uh, 
a by remaining readings. First stage is demodulation signal and note. This is DPCM output, this is demodulation output. I am using here CC2 CROs, DS1 and analog CRO, analog DS4 for digital data and encoded output, uh, demodulation for analog output. For uh, why it is if you low frequency signal so we are using the analog CRV for if you uh, if I want to observe the signal from here I'm getting with too much of distortion remove this one and connect this one. getting so much of distortion so I'm connected output here Okay, once again observe the connections.